Good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Shaz, and I'm here today representing the School of Engineering and Technology at PSB Academy. It is both my pleasure and honor to be your Master of Ceremony for this graduation event today. The COVID-19 pandemic has impacted businesses and individuals alike. Unfortunately, the education industry has not been spared. However, amidst this crisis, we have found ways to adapt and transform ourselves digitally, much like how we are conducting this graduation ceremony virtually today. To start the ceremony proper, please allow me to present Dr. Sam Chunyin, Dean of PSB Academy, to deliver his speech. Distinguished guests, colleagues, ladies and gentlemen, it is a wonderful privilege to join you in celebrating the achievements of our graduates. Graduates, I offer my heartfelt congratulations to you. Edith Coburn University and TSB Academy, as respected institutes of learning, share a common goal of providing our students with a quality global education that will empower you for the challenges of tomorrow. Our partnership has grown from strength to strength, and we will continue to deliver a higher education experience that prepares graduates for rich and fulfilling lives. Graduates, your achievement is worth celebrating. Getting a degree qualification is never easy. During your journey with us, you have to learn and apply difficult concepts and to solve challenging and unfamiliar problems. As Henry Ford said, thinking is the hardest work there is, which is probably the reason so few engage in it. It is therefore natural that you have found your learning journey challenging as you sought to make sense of the theories and terms in your course. This purposefully builds sophistication and resilience in your character and internalizes concepts that will enable you to be professionals in your chosen career. Graduates, you have made it. Today marks a significant milestone in your life. Whether you work for a small, medium enterprise or a multinational corporation, as a scientist or engineer, each day you will face decisions that test your courage and values. The training you received to reason, solve problems, and relate with others will be invaluable. In life, we may not always have the answers. We need to have a creative relationship with problems and think how best we can deal with them. The world is rapidly changing. We are in the so-called fourth industrial revolution and the pandemic has accelerated the digitalization of services. In this digital era, you have at your disposal a wide range of communication and information tools. The excellent education you receive today empowers you to pursue your passion. Today, we celebrate not just the end of a fruitful journey, but a launching point. So aim high and have the courage to try new ways. Danny Mayer has this to say, life is a series of waves to be embraced and overcome. As you run toward your future, never stop learning. Take up causes, keep up with the current affairs, listen to talks and read widely. Excel in tasks that machines will not be able to replicate and stand as equals with the best in the world. The secret to lifelong success is lifelong learning. In closing, I would like to urge you to keep in touch with Edith Coburn University and TSB Academy. Join us in our alumni events. We certainly look forward to hearing your future achievements. On behalf of PSB Academy, I wish you the very best as you embark on your next challenge. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Sam. 
Now, allow me to present Professor Steve Chapman, Vice Chancellor, Edith Cowan University, who will deliver his speech. Hello everyone, I wish I could have been there with you today. I'm Professor Steve Chapman and I'm the Vice Chancellor of Edith Cowan University. I want to welcome our distinguished guests, staff, alumni, and of course, our graduands and their proud parents and friends. As Vice Chancellor, it's an honor, a privilege, and a pleasure to congratulate our graduating students. Graduation ceremonies always remind me of the importance of education and of the role of universities in the world. So I'm delighted to be part of a ceremony that celebrates ACU's involvement in education in your country. To all our World Ready graduates here today, remember that you are the next generation who will go on to innovate and forge new paths to the answers the world is seeking. So go out and make a difference in the world and take with you the values we hold dear at ECU. So show respect to everyone, act with integrity, use rational inquiry and strive for personal excellence. You should feel tremendously proud, as we are, of your extraordinary achievements. There is nothing you cannot do, nothing. So go out and amaze people, go out and inspire people. In the end, whatever you do or achieve in your life, try to leave each person you encounter and the environment you walk through just that little bit better than it was before. Finally, today you have joined a global network of alumni, all proud to have studied at ECU. Our Office of Alumni Relations is committed to offering you a lifelong relationship with ECU. And I urge you to stay connected with us, beginning with today's event. Thank you, congratulations, and good luck. My name is Professor Paul Haskell Dowland, and I am the Associate Dean for Computing and Security in the School of Science at Edith Cowan University. Today it gives me great pleasure to celebrate our first graduating cohort from PSB Academy and I'm delighted to be a part of a ceremony that celebrates ECU's involvement in education in Singapore. We are very proud to partner with PSB Academy as one of Singapore's leading private education institutions with a 50-year heritage of producing industry-ready graduates that are active innovators and contributors to society. ECU is also a pioneer in cyber security education, recognised as one of only two academic centres of cyber security excellence by the Australian Federal Government. We are also the only institution in Australia to be invited to join the International Cyber Security Centres of Excellence. As you can see, I have huge pride in ECU and its accolades that you are now part of. The educational journey of the last couple of years has been anything but normal for our students and graduates. With the arrival of COVID-19, the world was dealt a crisis on a scale we have not seen for many decades. But despite the obstacles caused by the pandemic, each of you rose to the challenge and triumphed. You came to this university to explore, question and engage, indeed to improve yourselves. You are the next generation who will go on to make a difference in the world. And that is why I believe the future for you is a bright one. Now that you are ready to move on to the next stage of your life, I ask you to consider the following five pieces of advice. Number one, remember how you treat other people, particularly those that you may have influence or power over, will define you as a person and your impact on the world. Be kind. Two, listen to and appreciate your colleagues. Hearing is not the same as listening. Welcome people's feedback and reflect on it honestly. Number three, thank your colleagues for their help. Even small gestures of gratitude show people they matter and the benefits to you will be significant. Four, be trustworthy and show integrity. If you are honest, trusting and open with your colleagues, 
they will repay that trust and give you their respect. And finally, five. Be an enthusiast in everything you do. Passion and enthusiasm are the absolute keys in motivating and inspiring your colleagues. If you are not enthusiastic about what you want to do, why should other people be? So, you have a choice. You can either be a passive victim of circumstance, or you can be the action hero of your own life. Thank you, congratulations, and enjoy your day. Following this will be the presentation of awards. The names of all the graduates who are receiving awards today will be presented on screen. Congratulations to all our graduates for their achievements. Following this, I would like to call upon our valedictorian to deliver his speech. May I present Mr. T. Hock Nian Eric, representing his graduating cohort. Hello friends, my name is Hock Nian and I am one of the graduates in class 2021. I study cybersecurity in Attic Cohen University and I'm really happy to graduate from Ethicon University and PSB Academy. Uh, first of all, I want to take my time to thank all my lecturers and all the PSB staff that helped me during my days in school and also my parents were so supportive to me. You know, without all of this support, I don't think I can make this far. So, um, throughout my study, I had a chance to get exposed to many different cybersecurity related domains like penetration testing, machine learning and coding and I think it was really challenging for me but it was fun at the same time. So the most valuable lesson that I learned during the school is uh, adapting. So uh, I still remember vividly that the good old days with my friends when there's no pandemic yet and at all of a sudden, everything just changed in a blink of an eye. And, and I think that's how we learn to adapt to a new environment. And besides that, I want to congratulate all the graduates for making such a big achievement in your life. And good luck on starting a brand new life. And I hope that we can do better in our future and accomplish more in our future endeavors. So before I end this speech, I want to share a quote by Betty Reese. She said that, if you think you are too small to be effective, you have never been in a dark with a mosquito. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. T. Ladies and gentlemen, let us now view some congratulatory messages from the staff of PSB Academy. Before we end of this session, allow us to present a few messages from your former classmates, now fellow graduates. My journey to graduation with PSP Academy has been a very pleasant one. The faculty had been very supportive and the guidance received helped all of us surmount learning challenges on and off the campus. My learnings and deep research from Madrid Korean University has given me so much confidence. Thank you everyone. Hi, I'm Astik. My journey to graduation with PSB Academy was an unforgettable experience. I want to express my gratitude towards PSB Academy, ECU faculty for their continuous support and their guidance throughout the journey. Thank you so much. Hi guys, this is Sun and I would like to appreciate to all the lecturers who guided us along the study and also my classmates because we got through this tough time together. Hope all of us have a bright future. Bye bye. 
my graduation journey with PSP Academy was a memorable experience. I would like to thank all the PSP and Edith Cowan University faculty for their esteemed support and guidance throughout our academic time. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for taking the time to attend this ceremony today. Once again, we would like to express our heartfelt congratulations to the graduating cohort. I now declare this graduation ceremony closed. Thank you. Thank you.